matchup for you is the Southern Stings up against the Golden Fireballs. It is the bottom of the table clash in Division Number One. The uh, Golden Fireballs haven't won a match, and the Southern Stings have won two out of six so far. I must say I've been particularly impressed by the Stings because, you know, assumption is if you're coming from second division, you might end up bottom of the lock, and that hasn't been the case for the side because they've just maintained, you know, the play, the top of play that we've been accustomed to in the 2014 season. Obstruction, goal defense. What's been interesting for me is the level of goal competition defense. in Division 1 because the yes. competition has been very stiff between the sides. In fact, three sides have been at the top of the table over the season so far. The Jaguars, Northwest Flames and Crinums have all spent time at the top of the first division log and uh, that's uh, been competitive. The Jaguars with that win over the Northwest Flames earlier tonight going back to the top of the table. They've played a match more than the Crinums and uh, again Gianca Roda not able to find the net for the Fireballs. Chance here for Yolanda Dupria and she grabs the second goal of the match for the Fireballs. Contact goalkeeper, penalty pass a shot, yes. And another opportunity then for the Southern Stings to Barnes go ahead by off. another centre pass. It's a good finish by Helena Stein who's looking confident this evening. She has had her problems as far as confidence is concerned and maybe not enough pressure being put on her by Yanka Penning. 